Good day crafty chums, it's Nikki here, aka Carson Cat, aka Carson Cat Sly Fan. I'm coming at you today with a um ATCs. A ATCs? No, with ATCs. <laughs> the way I like to make my ATCs, as a lot of people do, is to make a mixed media background first. And here you can see that um uh, I've got some watercolour paper and it's taped down to uh, a little plastic mat little cutting mat and I've got some acrylic paints there liquid acrylics in the droppers I'm just dropping on <coughs> and air spraying and you know and then I'll dry it off in a bit uh, to try and not make mud you know that blue and uh, what's it purple and uh, orange make mud so I'm being, just being a little bit careful not to make mud because I don't like it. I don't like it when I make mud. <laughs> so you'll see me just you know, dripping in, dabbing off, drying up. And uh, yeah, I'm not going for any pattern or anything in particular there. I am just want it bright and I don't want mud. So that's what I'm doing. I really, really like those liquid acrylics because uh, they make a really nice bright background. So, you know, just uh, tapping off, pouring some more on, drying off, darkening up the colour because I went too light. So just, you know, making it vibrant again. It's not the best lighting there, it was at night and I've got my lights on so it does wash out the colours just a little bit uh, more than they are <laughs> but yeah, bringing it back making my mixed media background just adding some more red there so I'm going to see if I can talk through the whole of this one I may or may not because uh, quite often I'll just run out of something to say <laughs> So that's when I usually add music is when I've got no more to say. I'm using now the uh, Distress Oxides and a little um, a little texture mat, silicone mat that Josie gave me ages ago. And uh, I've still got it, still use it. It's one of my favourite mat making tools. And we all have our favourites, but um, that mat is one of mine. I've got a, um, a little script stamp there that... Um, uh, what I'm doing is um, uh, I've got verse mark ink there and it's quite dark so tapping it off on some so I get a, a lighter and a darker effect there. I've got some gesso there, full strength gesso and I'm going over, I wish I'd actually watered it down now but hey ho. <laughs> but um, yeah going over just to mix it in a little bit more. Moa. And I've got a little pair of uh, wings there that I'm just, um, I've got some more distress oxides and just stamping out the wings. That'd be nice. In fact, it uh, doesn't work very well in the end result, but um, it's okay. It's probably because of the distress oxides that it doesn't work out well. So here I am, just uh, cutting down my ATCs. And for those of you who have lived on another planet for the last couple of years, ATCs come in sizes uh, two and a half inches by three and a half inches and I managed to cut mine um, really well so I got hardly any waste on that paper and I didn't plan that out that's just how it worked out so I was quite lucky um, the watercolour paper was some I had left over so I just thought I'd do all of it and I really only had little bits left over so that was good I quite uh, quite like that. I'm just drawing out some designs now on the ATCs. That one's a fish. For those of you who can't see, it's a fish. <laughs> oh, this one is what? Did I get, did I go through them all to show you? Mm -hmm. I may or may not have. What's this? That is. Oh yeah, this one. Mm, this one is a chicken. Chicken! <laughs> Chicken again! And this one is... 
maybe a cat or it may be an owl is it a cat or an owl could be either at the moment I can't quite see I cannot see because it's too far away and I haven't got my glasses on this could be an owl or it could be a cat <laughs> Shapes for, uh, for a cat and owl are the same, so I don't know. And this one uh, is a little um, nesting doll thing, I think. Do they call them babushkas or a nesting doll? I could go and look it up, um, but I'm just being too lazy. So that's what that one is. And I'm just showing you here uh, how I do my negative space there with the black. I'm outlining in um, uh, liquid acrylic and it's Mars black. I may do all of them or I don't, can't remember whether I did all of them or just one or two to show you before I switched off. I may have actually done them all, who knows. It's going to be fishy. There's more detail to go on them yet, I'm just doing the, the easy negative space there. Looks like I did show you all. There we go, that's the owl, which is the same shape as the cat, the outside shape. Oh yeah, so I did it and this, this is my chicken. And um show how much of this I'll show you, I don't know. I may just show shown you one and uh, and did all the yeah, the sides of me there you can see the pile. <laughs> So I'm just showing you how I finish this this one off. Because I've already done the others, so yeah, just taking a slip of water. It's a cute little chicken, isn't it? Chicken! <laughs> cute little chicken! And then I'm just uh, doing a little frame around the chicken and I may add some leaves or I may not. What did I do? I added leaves. There you go. Leaves. Added leaves. <laughs> just showing you up close and showing you the others that I did. I think I've got some more work to do on them uh, after. I just felt like uh, I needed to do a little bit of extra. There, there you go. Look. Now I've just slowed it down a little bit more so you can see that I'm just doing a little bit of extra on there. After all that fast work it's like, oh no, I'm going so slow. <laughs> and this is um, uh, sped up times two. I think I actually work quite slowly. Yeah, so just tidying them up really, the ATCs. You know, getting pencil marks off and all that so I just want to say thank you very much for joining me today hope you like the ATCs that I did there with my negative spaces and um, I'll just use that word <laughs> just because I felt like it negative space ATCs just to get your attention <laughs> and um, yeah so thank you for watching uh, please do subscribe if you like what you see and you're not already subscribed subscribed don't know whether I can't say subscribed I have real problems with that one must be the teeth I'm really buck teeth and ugly you know it's like man thick glasses buck teeth you know freckles spots warts that's why you never see me on screen <laughs> just kidding um yeah so if you like what you see please subscribe uh if you can like share you know give me the old thumbs up ring my bell because I really really like it when you ring my bell um, yeah, do all that good stuff, you know, leave me a kind comment, because I like kind comments, and I'll see you again soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.